artist Rebecca L.S., the channel that inspires you every day. Subscribe or I'll throw paint at you. To support my channel even more, like the video, subscribe and watch a playlist or two. Don't forget to comment. Today I'm creating a painting using only batteries, a little bit of a paintbrush and a mosquito block, which is plastic. I've already painted the background using a paintbrush and that's really the only time I use it for the black and the grey kind of background. I know grey was a challenge for me but I achieved it. I then went on to use the plastic block you can see there that's green. It's kind of curved so I was able to do the bottom in white and create the moon shape. And then I just touched up using the paintbrush because the shape did come out a little bit solid and rigid so I just had to add a little bit more of a curve with the paintbrush but the basic shape had been achieved. I'm now dipping in to the paint uh, AA batteries and the AAA batteries. They're different sized batteries and so you can achieve the bigger and the smaller stars just by dipping the little knobbly end into the paint. And I started with the larger AA battery knobbly bit and now I've changed up to the smaller one so that I can add even tinier little stars and I'm kind of grouping them together now you can see because sometimes you get clusters of stars. And now I'm going to be moving on to doing some printing using the acrylic mosquito block. Well, it's not acrylic, it's a plastic mosquito block. But it reminds me of an acrylic block when we're stamping or a rocker block by um, Crafter's Companion. They came out with a stamping thing called a rocker block that you rock in order to um, create your stamped image. So this is actually um, mosquito repellent inside and it lasts for about three months and the air holes are shaped like leaves so I decided to uh, coat one half of it in green gouache paint which is the Arteza brand and I'm then sticking it down on the paper um, all across the bottom to create a kind of hedge effect. And I'm going back to the batteries now and tipping them on their side once half of the side is coated in grey gouache. And I'm dragging it down in a downwards um, direction so that we are spreading the paint out into oblong shapes. Because these are going to be my blocks of flaps or just office blocks. And now I'm just finishing off. And this is what it looks like when it's finished. What do you think? Click the two videos on screen now and when you do, you're going to get even more inspiration.